Hey guys, this is Nico, and in this short tutorial, I'm just going to give you the basics of Facebook ads in just five minutes, and I'm going to show you how you can set up your very first ad. Now, let's get started. The first thing you need to do is to go to adsmanager.facebook.com. From the ads manager is where you manage all of your ads. You're going to see a screen that looks exactly like this. On the left, you have a menu, and from this menu, you can use the audiences to create audiences. You can use the billing and payments to set your payment method. You can use your ad account settings to connect pixels and so on. And from O2s, something that you need to do before you get started is go to business setting, set up your pixel, link your Instagram page and link your Facebook page to your ads manager. Once you do that, you're ready to set up your ads. So we're going to click on campaigns and we're going to go to the ads manager. So from the ads manager, you're going to see that you have a time frame resets. So you can choose the date based on the date. You can view how your campaigns are performing. You have a columns so you can organize your campaigns based on performance, engagement, performance and, and clicks, delivery or video engagement. If you click this, you can customize your own columns from the breakdown. You can break down your campaigns based on day, age, placement, country. You can break them by time, by demographics, by, by geography and so on. So if you want to set your first campaign, here's what you need to do. You can click on create and from the menu here, you can choose your campaign objective. If you want to get sales, optimize your campaign for sales. If you want to get leads, optimize your campaigns for leads. And those are the two most common ones. So I'm going to click sales. I'm going to click continue. Here is going to ask you to choose a campaign setup. I usually use manual sales campaigns, and this is what I recommend you do if you're just starting out. So I'm just going to click continue. Here I'll be under campaign name. So I'm just going to give this campaign a name. I suggest you give your campaign a name that you can easily understand and remember. So usually I name my campaigns after the product and I'm going to add the objective. So let's say my product name is online course for weight loss. I'm going to name this campaign online course for weight loss dash sales. So special categories here. I'm just going to leave this empty campaign details, the bidding time. I'm going to leave action catalog. I'm just going to leave this the way it is campaign objective. I'm going to keep it sales because this is something we set up earlier. Advantage campaign budget. I usually leave this on and here I set my campaign budget, which I suggest you keep at 20 if this is your first campaign. So here you have this option to increase the budget during specific time periods, but this is something I never use. And I'm going to click next in this menu, the ad set level, we're going to choose our targeting for this campaign. I'm looking to get website sales. So I'm just going to choose the website and app. And again, I, I'm going to name this ad set campaign for the country I'm targeting. So here is going to be United States and the interest would be weight loss. So I'm going to scroll a little bit down. So here you're going to see a little disclaimer saying a website event is required. That means you need to set up the pixel. It's going to ask you for the cost per goal. I'm going to leave this empty here. You can schedule your campaign. So it runs for a particular period of time. So let's say I want to run these ads from February 1st till February 28th. And I'm going to leave the way this audience control from audience control. You can set the location. I'm going to click show more options. I'm going to click edit. I'm going to choose United States because this is from where I want my traffic. Then minimum age, I'm going to leave the way these languages. Feel free to play with the languages. But here I suggest you do English if you want to target the United States. And what I do is usually I select English O. Advantage audience plus. Uh, I usually choose switch to original audience. And once I switch to ori original audiences, I use detailed targeting. So here I'm going to do weight loss or something related to weight management. So here from the detailed targeting, I'm just going to target a specific interest. I'm going to click on browse. I'm going to select interests. I'm going to support. I'm going to scroll a little bit down and maybe sports and outdoors. And I'm going to target people who are interested in running marathons here. If I want to change the age, I can change the age from, let's say, 31 to, let's say, 60. The gender, I can choose between men, woman or all gender. So let's say woman, I'm just going to target female. Else. I'm going to scroll a little bit down placement. I'm going to leave it the way this, and this is how I set my targeting. So I'm targeting women in the United States who are interested in marathons. And if I want to create my first ad, I'm just going to click next and the ad creation menu will appear. So I'm just going to give my ad a name and I'm just going to name it just ad number one uh, here. I'm just going to link my Facebook page and my Instagram account. If you don't see this here, you need to go to the from this menu and you need to select business settings and you add your Facebook page and Instagram account. So you'll be able to see it here. Then I'm going to scroll a little bit down. I'm going to select ad setup, create ad. Um, I'm going to do manual upload. I'm going to scroll a little bit down and where it says multi advertiser ads, I'm just going to leave it the way it is. I'm going to select single image or video in the ad creative. I'm going to choose a ad creative. Um, I'm going to upload an image. So let's see the image I'm going to pick is going to be, let's say this one. I'm, I'm marketing a book on AI. I'm going to select the image. I'm going to select how the image will appear on each placement. So for example, you can see the feeds and in-stream videos. You can see the story in reels and you can see the right column. I don't like how this looks like. So I'm just going to go back to original here. I might do the recommended. So I'm going to click next. Uh, all enhancements, I'm going to turn this off. And I'm going to click done. And this is how my ad will look like. But as you can see, my ad doesn't have any text. So primary text, I'm just going to say, hello, my name is Nico, buy my book. And I'm going to leave it at this because this is just for educational purposes. So as you can see, there is no headline. The headline will be my new book, my new book on AI marketing. And I'm going to include a description. The description is my brand new book is just out. So this is it. I suggest you spend a lot more time on coming up with a much better ad copy and much better headline. But right now time is of an essence. So I'm just going to do it quickly. I can change the button. So the button will be sign up and here I just need to add the website URL. So I'm going to add nicovelikov.com and this is how my ad looks like. And once I click publish, the audience I target will see 
this image, this ad, they're going to start clicking and hopefully they'll start buying. So this was the very quick five minute tutorial on, on setting up your first Facebook ads campaign. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. If you need more detailed tutorial on how to set up your ads, make sure you click the link you see on the screen because this is my detailed tutorial on setting up Facebook ads. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.